machine delivery. Not too bad. I think we have our very first dud. <laughs> Hey team, welcome to today's video and welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel. My name is Hayden. The rustling, I'm sure you can hear that. We have another Sheen delivery. I have done two other videos of Sheen before and I've got an unpublished one that I am yet to put together and put up. I have got myself three more articles from Sheen. I've decided to give pants, trousers, whatever it is that you call them in your country, one more go. The last two have not been great. So here's hoping third time's a charm. What I've purchased and what we're going to be unveiling today and looking at for the first time is the men's solid half button shirt. This is all in Australian dollars, which was 19.95. The men's striped skinny pants, gray, 43.95. And then the men's striped hem plush lined jacket, which was 51.95. Now, when you compare the prices of these three items to my initial purchase from Sheen, this is higher up the scale, so it's a bit more expensive. Now, based on the first review where the quality was great, and to this day, I still wear the jacket and the black T drawstring hooded shirt, and I have purchased other items from Sheen as well. I'm hoping that the quality is going to be consistent in here. That was not the case in my unpublished video, which I may or may not just add into this video. No time like the present, let's get started. Okay, we've done this a couple of times, so we know what to expect. They come in sealed pouches. I really like the quality of the packaging that they send. It keeps it nice and tidy. We've got the shirt, the pants, which feel all right, and then the jacket. We're gonna start with the shirt. I always like to do the crunch test. Okay, this feels different to the drawstring shirt in my initial one. It feels thinner and cheaper. Even though this is kind of comparative. You can, hopefully you can see, but there's a window directly behind the camera and you can see straight through it. There's no give. Even though the quality of the fabric itself doesn't feel the same as the initial t-shirt or shirt that I purchased, the construction looks pretty good. But there are no threads. I don't see any bunching. Even on the inside in the hem, it looks pretty good. Let's try it on. Can't say that I'm much of a fan of this. It's rather boxy and unflattering and very, very restrictive around the arms and the shoulders. And this is all supposed to be a medium. It feels big around the waist and very small around the shoulders and the arms. I think we have our very first dud. Right, well, that was not a good fit. The material felt like it didn't really breathe, really uncomfortable. I'm a little disappointed in this shirt. Oh well, first one, not so great. My last chance with pants or shorts or slacks from Sheen. Let's give them a go. Interesting, the packaging for these, it doesn't have Sheen on the film. Whereas the other two, both of the other two packages, that was the shirt and this one's the jacket. Interesting. Taking them out, first impressions. That crinkling is not the pants. There's something in here. Crate paper. First impressions, it's actually quite soft. Very soft material. They are a slim fit. I believe I got too big a size. <laughs> yeah, these are gonna be really big on me and that's on me. I think I ordered the wrong size. I'm usually a 34 and these are a 36. We'll just have to wait and see. You can see along the hem, it's even, even the stitching. Okay, it's not wonky. I guess this would be a little off center. 
and that it doesn't feel like super thin material. It's 70% polyester, 25% rayon, and 5% spandex. <laughs> There's the stretch for you. Let's try them on. Here we have the pants. Now they are too big for me. However, that's my own fault. That's not on the company. They still look all right though. So they're not too bad. They fit well and they're not super tight. Because I've got the wrong size, they do kind of hang down a bit. So keep that in mind. Yeah, not bad. Definitely so much better than the last two bottom half purchases I got from Sheen. Okay, so for the first time, pants from Sheen, not too bad. Lucky last, the one thing that I was actually looking the most forward to was the jacket. And that's based on my first purchase. The first jacket I got from Sheen was pretty good. And I actually really love it. It's one of my staples in my wardrobe. So here's hoping this is the same. Same packaging. We know what to expect there. First impressions, feeling the fabric. It feels nice. It feels... Um, just like the last time, real metal in the zip. Here's what she looks like. Once out, looking at the construction, once again, it looks very well made. If we open it up. Oh, that is nice. Very, very nice. That'll be quite warm in winter. Let's try it on. Oh, perfect fit. Everything I got from the waist up is a medium. That's my size. So it's nice to see that it's a true size match. You'll need to let me know what you think, but I think this is actually really nice. I think it fits quite well and it's very well made. And for 50 something dollars, we got another home run. Here is the jacket. So comfortable, fits so well. And the material, it feels like you've just gone into a store and you've picked it up off the racks. Like this, I would, I could definitely see myself purchasing something like this at say Maya or David Jones. Very impressed. And there we have it. We got our three items of clothing. Two of the three pieces of clothing are pretty bloody good. The only dud was the shirt, which I'm quite surprised because every other shirt that I've ever gotten from Sheen, and I've actually purchased quite a few from there, has been pretty good with the exception of a button up that I got in my last unpublished video, which I may or may not finish. And for the first time, I got bottoms from Sheen that were pretty good. All right, team, I recommend that you check out Sheen if you haven't already. It seems that their jackets are pretty good. And the, the shirts can be 90% of the time, that's actually pretty good. And then the flip that, with the pants, 10% of the time, it's okay. Thanks for watching. Make sure you do all the fun stuff, but most importantly, stay tuned.